welcome back. My name's Guy. I'm going to be with you for the next two hours. Merry Christmas Eve to everybody out there. Uh, you still have the ability to take advantage of some really great deals here at HSM. We've got wonderful stuff. Our today's special is coming up in our next hour. Um, we got these beautiful knives, which I'll get to in just a sec, but I wanted to remind everybody that we are still uh, in the midst of our clearance. And with our clearance, if you spend $75, you get free shipping on everything that you filled up in the cart with, uh, with clearance. So it's a great deal and a great way to get started. I also wanted to mention something I got coming up a little bit later. Um, and this is our Kitchen HQ two quart digital pressure cooker. In my opinion, if you've never owned a pressure cooker before, this is a great one to try, all right? It's only a two quart, so you don't have to commit to a big giant pressure cooker, yet you still have great capacity inside here. So if you wanna do a little pot roast or if you wanna do corned beef or if you wanna do chili, whatever, it's completely digital, it's easy to use, and it doesn't take up a lot of space. Perfect for empty nesters. Like if you got two to four people, you're gonna love this. It's also great if you, are, if you have a big family to do your side dishes, you can cook anything in it. And the best part is you get all day flavor with a fraction of the cooking time. I have all colors available, right? Right now, I think it comes in black and blue, and it comes in red. It comes in uh, this great taupe color, and then it also comes in teal. Easy to use, comes with a little paddle. Well, that's great for rice or whatever you're stirring in there. Look at the clearance price. It's 29 bucks for a pressure cooker. You gotta get that today, you're gonna love that. Uh, but I wanted to mention really quickly our knives before I walk over and, and show you what we're offering. This is our Kitchen HQ, what we call the 10-piece wavy angle knife set. Um, you can go out and spend $150 on one knife, which is a great deal, or you can get the high-quality Kitchen HQ for a fraction of the price. This is $19.95 for an entire set. And when you look at how beautiful these knives are and how well-made they are, they have this wavy design built into the blade itself. This basically is for easy release. Uh, you create a little bit of air between whatever it is you're slicing in the knife itself and this gives you an incredible cut with easy release so if you're doing things like cheese or whatever it makes it very very easy it's a nice thick knife so it is sharpenable you're going to get not one but you're going to get five of these wonderful knives they all come with the sheaths and we'll get to what each knife is going to be but follow me over my good friend John Florell is here. He's going to get you started. And John, like myself, um, you know, we're kind of outdoorsy guys. I know he likes to fish and do all that stuff, and he appreciates good knives. Uh, we love to cook in the kitchen as well. Yes. This is five knives on sale today. Normally 34 on sale for $19.95. Unbelievable. I love the design of these, and I've yeah. used them. They're amazing. Well, the reason, yeah. you know, I, I, I mean, most people think, well, a knife is a knife is a knife. As long as it's sharp, right. it'll work. Well, these are not only sharp. But you'll notice the blade, you, Guy, you mentioned it earlier. It has those ridges or the yes. ribs, the, that rib design. And you'll notice that the, the rib design is kind of like angled or bent yes. as it goes through the blade. Now, it's a thick knife, okay, with a razor sharp edge. And you need a razor sharp edge to get a slice like this. But you'll notice as I'm slicing through this tomato or tomato, whatever you, <laughs> you'll notice not a piece moves. I mean, right. it slides through there like a hot knife goes through butter. So when you're doing your chopping, slicing, dicing, uh, mincing or julienning in the kitchen, you never have to worry about anything sticking to the blade Yes. because the air channels create that wave of air in between so nothing sticks to the blade. When you chop that cucumber, notice if you did that with a straight knife, cucumbers, oh, cucumbers would, be, would flying, be flying all over right? the place exactly. because it creates a suction between that slice Yep. and the blade. And that's why I like to lay that cucumber up there and show you that nothing will stick to the blade. Now, this is the chef's knife, the one that I'm using here, yep. okay? It also comes with a great bread knife. Now, this one looks a little bit different. You'll notice the handles are a full tang, okay? See, it has metal all the way to the end. And you'll also notice each knife is labeled. So if you're gonna give this as a housewarming gift or maybe it's a, a college student that needs a good set of knives. Yeah, Or maybe, perfect. you know, uh, yeah. Start uh, a kit for anybody, right? right? So this is a, per a beautiful scallop knife. And I'll tell you, everything comes with its own sheath. You'll notice the sheaths are aerated so they dry great on the drying rack. You also get the Nakiri. Now this little Nakiri is perfect for your herbs, for spices, for garlic, for uh, for yep. things like, well, for salads. You're gonna love that for your veggies too. It comes with the slicer, okay, the slicing knife. This is a great knife if you're an outdoorsman. It's a perfect yeah. filet knife carving. or a boning knife for carving. It's got yeah. that nice, uh, it's got about an inch and a quarter blade from the sharp end to the top, to the top to, of the blade. And again, these are all full tang, okay? And they all have that silicone handle. Last but not 
not least, our beautiful paring knife, which you'll use for paring, peeling, slicing, dicing, and decorating. I'll show you that too. But I'll tell you what, let me take the chef's knife over here because I, I think, do I have, I don't have a fork here, so I'm just gonna use my fingers. Look at okay. this. I mean, it's like a razor blade on a handle. You can slice perfect, beautiful, thin slices. And again, because of that aeration on the blade, because of those ridges, it creates that air between the vet, whatever it is that you're cutting and the blade. So you, nothing sticks to this blade. So if you wanna slice something, <laughs> you know it's gonna slice, okay? But nothing ever sticks to the blade. So you can do all that fun stuff in the kitchen that you couldn't do with a normal kitchen knife. Now you can. These are gonna become, for 20 bucks, they're gonna become your favorite knives to use in the kitchen because of the handle, the comfort grip, and that razor sharp blade. I gotta tell you, this little paring knife, now we made this up earlier. You can take a honeydew, a cantaloupe, a watermelon, this is very simple, okay? You take the tip of the knife, and, and what I do is I put it on the side and I make a circle all the way around. I just twist around like this, and then I, car I, I draw out a handle, and then you take the point of the knife and you just push it in, and then you take it out, yeah. and then you turn it to an angle, and you follow that around. And look at this, you can make these at home. It's very simple and easy. Oh, look, that okay? one came stuffed with, stuffed cottage, with cottage cheese. Stuffed with cottage cheese. You can do <laughs> melon balls. You can do all kinds of fun stuff with that's this. That's awesome. And that's all done with that yep. razor sharp paring knife. Now we also have, and no matter what color you choose, these knives, I gotta tell you, I'm gonna move this over here. Cause I gotta tell you what, these knives are razor sharp. You're gonna love them if you have an outdoorsman in your life. You wanna slice, uh, you wanna slice something, or if you wanna fillet. I mean, these are razor sharp from tip to toe. Look at that. If you wanted to fillet, a fish with this knife, you'll fillet that fish. That guy, listen, you'll fillet a fish so fast, that fish will swim around the bucket naked for an hour. He'll probably die of pneumonia before he even knows <laughs> he's, he's missing his birthday suit. I mean, Look at that. They're razor right. sharp let knives. Me, let me remind you, you have a choice of either blue, they come in blue, they come in black, or they come in red. I only have 100 left in red at this price at only $20 for all five knives. Even if you've got a great set of knives and you're looking for another set of utility knives, or maybe knives to take with you, you go camping or whatever it is, is their ideal. Um, I love the fact that you're getting the Nakiri. That's a really hard knife to find, and that's included in the kit as well. Um, so about 900 total knives remain if you want to get it on clearance today. And remember, 75 bucks in clearance gives you free shipping on everything. So before you look at the shipping costs, fill the card up with $75 worth of stuff. We got plenty for you to pick from today, and you're going to love it. I, I think what a lot of people out there downplay the importance of really good knives. Oh, yeah. You know, chefs don't, but, but a lot of people are like, eh, knives knife. It's not true. You want to get that great uh, 1810 stainless. You want them forged properly. You want to use the right type of steel. What I love about these two, John, uh, they're thicker knives so, they're, so you can sharpen them for years. Yes. But also that handle is, I mean, I want you to imagine, it, it's this like handle when you were amazing. a kid and you'd wrap yeah. tape around the handle of a bat. Oh, and I make know. It, this <laughs> is like a rubberized super soft grip. It gives a little bit, so it actually works with your hand. It's very, very comfortable. Anybody out there that has issues with the hand will love that. Uh, the fact that you have that. And this this knife and the curry, this is one of, you'll probably use this knife more than any other knife. You will. When you see how great Once it Once you chops. start using it, oh, yes, yeah. you're gonna be chopping away. Now, this one actually is one of my favorite knives, okay? this uh, we, we call it the scalloped blade. I call it the bread and, and spread I knife. I call it, yeah, it is. <laughs> because <laughs> right? you're gonna love it as a bread knife. Uh, you can, you, you'll use this knife as a bread knife because it's razor sharp. It's got, it's not a serrated edge, it's a scalloped edge. So as you're cutting, uh, you can do angel food cake without crushing it. You can do soft, fresh bread without crushing it. Again, nothing sticks to that uh, handle or that blade. But I, and just to show you real quick, I gotta show you this because when I say nothing sticks to the blade, look at this. Here's some wet mozzarella yeah, that's cheese. That's some of the stickiest If you've ever tried there. to slice this by hand, wow. with a, you know, with a with a regular flat bladed knife, as soon as I picked that knife up, that chunk of cheese would come up with it, and then that's you'd be peeling demo. it off like this and, yeah. and tearing it apart. Because you got air in there. You never yeah. have to worry about it because of those air channels. So when you're slicing, take a look at this. Now, and here's the other thing I love about this too. It's got that wide blade to it, but it comes to a point, and this is actually designed to get down into a mayonnaise jar. Perfect. Or a, or a condiment jar, or a jar it's jug. It's the perfect look size at this. for a piece of it's bread. It's the perfect <laughs> spread knife for spreading, and then, and you can slice your sandwich. I mean, when I talk, when I say 
perfect bread knife. Look yeah. at that. You'll see I mean, these knives in delicatessens <laughs> yes. all across the world. Yeah. Hey, let me just remind you. And this you, knife on its own, guy, if yeah. it's sold by itself, oh, it's a you can't knife. find this yeah. for the price that you're paying for the entire set so, in, in so stores. Look, red is almost sold out. Okay, I've got about uh, maybe 40 or 50 sets of red left. And I'm still okay on black and blue if you want to get it. This is ideal. Maybe you got kids that, you know, maybe just graduated and they moved into an apartment. You're like, you know what? Get them a great set of knives. I love they all come with the sheaths. They're all dish safe, although I never throw my knives in the dishwasher because I think it's a waste of time. I, and I also I, I also don't like to, I don't want to worry about putting my hand in a dishwasher and grabbing a razor sharp blade. Right. Um, even though you can put the sheaths in there with them, rinse them off, put them back in the thing, let them dry. It's the best way to do it. And that's, there's <laughs> the point right there. That's it right there. Yeah, it makes Everything. slicing easy. I mean, I can lay it flat and keep it on there, but as soon as I turn that knife to where I'm going to be using it, everything slides right off. Nothing sticks to the blade. It saves you time. It saves you hassle. And it's a safer knife to use in the kitchen. Because you're slicing paper, you can slice paper thin. It gives you that control because nothing is sticking to that blade. So you yep. get the, done, the job done faster. Yep. And again, that wet mozzarella, again, look at this. Nothing will stick to the blade. I can slice right through that. And as soon as I lift that knife up, you get perfect. And look at this. There's not a tear, a rip, or a shred in that yeah. piece of cheese. And they, yeah. and they really, they're perfectly balanced knives yeah. versus the, the blade versus the handle. I've got it on one finger, and you can see I'm holding it by the bolster right there, and it's really, really well balanced. All of them That's are. how you know a really great knife. So remember, when you hold a knife, you hold right over the bolster. That's how you hold it. Yep. You don't hold it here. You hold it with one finger right there. That gives you the best control, and tuck your finger under, um, and you will absolutely love these knives. Last call on red. There is only about two dozen left in red if you want to get it. It's it's a uh, 200 now left in black uh, and then about uh, maybe about three or four hundred left in the blue if you want to pick this up they all work the same so it's just a matter of what your color preference is but if you, need, love hey, this listen, if you need to stick some mail on, a, on bread this is the way to do it <laughs> hey don't forget you get twenty dollars off if you get a brand new hsn credit card today take advantage of that john florell thank you my friend hey thank you great merry job. christmas everyone you too buddy you too we'll see you soon take advantage of the twenty dollars off you can use it on any item that you pick up, it just goes into your account as soon as you activate your new credit card. And there's no fees or nothing, and it's really a great a great card to have. So grab that while you can. All right, <clears throat> a while back, I was introduced to the housewarming uh, ceramic uh, uh, bakeware. And I will tell you, I own a couple of these, and I, I bought, actually bought the little the pie plates. And they are not only the most charming, because listen, I love charming, but you know, I, I'm a restaurant guy, so I want stuff that really works. Oh yeah. This stuff is, is amazing. This is high-fired uh, and glazed ceramic. It is beautiful to cook in both on the outside and on the inside, and it does such a great job. These are oven safe to 400 degrees. You can put them in the freezer, you can put them in the microwave, and of course you can bake in them. I absolutely love them. They are made from stoneware. They come with the little display rack. So when your lasagna comes out of the oven, you can put it in the rack and bring it right out to the table. These are all 45% off. We're gonna start with the large ceramic roaster, which is just an absolute no-brainer. This stuff is great for hot food, cold food. Put it in the oven, serve it right at the table. It's gorgeous. So pretty. Uh, in this, I have it in black, gray, green, blue. Do I still have beige? I think I, beige, all right, so beige did sell out. That, that minty green that you're seeing in the forefront there, that is absolutely gorgeous. It's so Kelly Deedream is this here. this is some of my favorite stuff. Happy Christmas Eve. Happy Christmas Eve. Isn't this Happy fun? Happy Christmas Eve. Merry Christmas. It's, it is Happy fun. holidays. Yeah. Happy New Year. This is so ridiculously holiday. It's so beautiful. But you can use it anytime. But well, it's you're going to so, use it all year. Yeah, you use it all yes. year. But I love the, the understated yep. country charm of this It is, of this but it's bakery. rustic. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah, So yeah. it's not overly country. Uh, no, I would no, say no. this would go with any decor. This is the gray that I have got here. Two six-pound chickens. So you could easily do... Uh, a turkey breast or sure. a smaller turkey. Um, I mean, look at how gorgeous, and you said it's stoneware. We've been cooking in stoneware, forget this, thousands of years. Since the stone age. Since the stone age. <laughs> it's a ceramic glaze, so it's all chemical free, obviously. Um, it goes to 400 degrees, so you're gonna bake in it, but more importantly, you're gonna serve in it. And we all know that we eat with our eyes first. So, for example, I mean, how beautiful of a presentation. Those are You would take really this nice. right from the oven, yeah. and then it comes with the wire rack on the roasting pan. The roasting pan is 13 by nine and a half by three. 
13 by nine and a half by three. Yeah. This is a good size roasting pan. And then look what guys got. It comes with the with included the lid. lid. You know, I, Don't put the lid in the oven, but other than that, how wonderful is that to 18, have? $18 for this. Are you kidding That's me? That's crazy. And the plastic Grab these lid. up. So, so even if you make lasagna twice a year, oh, yes. you need to get this pan because Take it's it to deep. grandma's. Yeah. Yes. yes. It's deep. Um, it, it's the perfect size for, and let me tell you, lasagna this big, 20 people. Oh, easily. You We've would, got the lasagna right here. 20, you could feed 20 people because of that three inch depth. And look, we actually have one right here. We have the lasagna, yeah. and you can see the, the, this, the wire rack makes it absolutely spectacular. And look, when you take it with you, yep, it you comes just pop with the that lid, lid on. I can put this in my car now and not worry about taking that right hand turn and, you know, having it yeah. scooch all over or the place. Put it in the fridge without foiling it up. Exactly. Look at the presentation, though, alone, just to go to the party, the neighbor's, you know, uh, anniversary party party or the birthday party or the girls night out whatever the case may be you're going to be able to have that beautiful presentation with that ceramic stone where I cannot believe we're on clearance I know we're just at the very end of our quantity I can't believe this is less than twenty dollars let's this look piece. at the one that's empty and the rack comes with it the rack comes with it so maybe grab one for you one for the gift closet one for you one for your sister-in-law sure um, this one I think is the blue but I wanted to show you the outside versus the inside so the outside is the dark with sort of the light herb pattern you can see all of our different herbs yeah. Yeah. But then this is all hand painted, by the way. This is not like They're machines beautiful. stamping these out. It goes to the light with the dark. So you can see it's mostly the light with the ceramic glaze. And then it has the dark herb pattern. So you can see it's sort of the opposite on the inside as it is on the outside. But it goes all the way around. It's ceramic all the way around. So underneath, on the inside, on the outside. It's stoneware. Why do we like cooking with ceramic stoneware? Couple of reasons. It's naturally nonstick. No chemical sprays right. or spritzes. I can use, you know, stainless steel utensils, metal utensils, but more importantly, it retains the heat. So not only do you have that even heat distribution throughout, yeah. but when I take my lasagna, let's say out of my oven at 375 degrees, yeah. and I take it table side, it will maintain the heat throughout the duration of my meal. Yeah, oh, it so does. So everybody yeah. that gets a slice of lasagna it is going to get the for, it stays, it stays hot, hot for an hour. hour. Hours, yeah. yes, yeah. absolutely. Uh, let's open this one. You can see here we did some Swedish meatballs. Whatever the case is, Ooh, whether you use it good. as a roasting pan. you do, pan. pineapple and peppers uh, Yeah, in there? we did a little bit of what? a, isn't that beautiful? But look at the presentation alone. Look at how put together you are. I love things that make me appear put together when maybe internally I'm not. I'm sort of a mess. <laughs> not you, Kelly. Well, you know, sometimes your mind's going a million miles are, an hour. Well, I know you personally, and I know you're juggling a lot of stuff. Yeah, we got yeah. a lot going on. We but if we on. can look like we're put together look at how I mean look at how gorgeous that is whether you're taking it with you somewhere and you pop that lid on top or whether you're just serving dinner at home for you your family yeah. maybe it's your neighbors that are coming over maybe you're hosting a baby shower a bridal shower somebody's birthday party yeah. look at how beautiful Let them that keep is it as a gift right? oh gosh I mean, no get one and then so, get them one. so here's here's <laughs> what I'll tell you at 18 bucks this is going very quickly uh, the it's blue so is the most gorgeous. popular right now I have it in blue and in green um, I still have it available in uh, gray as well and then it also comes in black we have other pieces that we're going to get to we have our uh, square uh, and they pan, all our loaf match pan. together we have the pie plates which are which are coming up and i love those because they're different from traditional pie pie plates they're deeper which may allows you to make a better pie but i want you i want to tell you go for it you are going to love the quality of these you have till the end of january if you want to return anything um but take advantage get your 20 dollar uh, gift card with your new h and credit card and you get most of this stuff for free and remember uh if you spend 75 dollars on clearance you get free shipping and handling so it's a really good idea if you want to get a few sets of these or if you want to buy something from each member of the uh, ceramic family and look at that release though i mean you can well, see that it's ceramic cheese. because it's ceramic, you know so ceramic it's natural. is i mean it's baked at 2000 degrees exactly okay? believe it or not i used to have a, many many years ago i knew a person that had a kiln and I, yeah, Was yeah. it like about 2,000 years ago? No, it wasn't. No, because she was she used to do tiles and things like no, that. No, that's wonderful. And she had a kiln in the house, and I was like, how? And she goes, it's like 1,600 to 2,200 degrees. That's what they do with ceramic, which is what cures the ceramic onto it and gives you that nonstick, but it also uh, bakes the glaze on, which gives you that great color. Um, ideal if you are a baker. You're going to love oh, the results that you get on this because this. you get even cooking with stoneware. 
Uh, a lot of metal pans are thicker on the bottom or thicker on the sides and you don't get even cooking. These are exactly the same thickness and density all the way around, and so you get natural. very balanced cooking. I mean, cooking. to me, yeah. that's really important um, because, you know, there's a lot of non-stick cookware, bakeware uh, out there, and we're always worried about, um, you know, is it gonna leach out chemicals, or do I have to worry about what kind of utensils I use on it? You know, non-stick scares me sometimes, not all the time, uh, but sometimes <laughs> non-stick freaks sometimes. me out a little. Uh, depends on who the manufacturer well, is, well, no, because right? You have to know like, why really here at HSN? Doesn't, you can make mistakes with non-stick. You can, and therefore, and that's why I love ceramic. It's all natural, right? So it's stoneware, it's that ceramic, which is almost like the glass glaze, um, and then it's oven safe to 400 degrees. It comes with the lid. It comes with the wire rack included. Yeah. I don't think I don't think we have black, do we? Did black sell out? I don't know, but black is actually my favorite. Black is gone as oh, well. Oh, it's so beautiful. All right. my, I like I like that gray and I like interior. that green. Although everybody's picking the blue, we're we're down to 200 left in blue. This is only 18 dollars. Easily for worth the roaster 50 bucks. and yeah. the wire and rack. And the rack and, and the, the lid. lid. It's yeah. three pieces. I like how they look just sitting out there on the table. And you know what's nice to you? No, no trivet needed because this actually sits, sits above. above. Yeah. Yeah, you can take it right from the oven and you can take it table side. Uh, remember, and if you're just joining us, it's ceramic, it's stone where it retains the heat, which means, let's like, say it's a lasagna or maybe it's our taco casserole that I just served up. Maybe it's your meatballs um, or maybe it's your cheesy potato casserole, this your scalloped like, potatoes. This looks like corn chips green on top beans. of that casserole. It is it's a taco casserole. Taco casserole. Yeah. What, what's what, what's wrong with that? Nothing. Nothing. nothing taco in, casserole. There is nothing in life wrong with, with those it. those little Frito things on top. So you can, you know what you it's can have fun with this. It's just ground beef, cheese, scallions. This you know instantly if you're a brand new cook, right? Maybe you're a young person. This immediately gives you credit. Yeah, it, it does. Immediately it does. gives you props, right? Because you're like, okay, look at how beautiful that. Everybody needs a little bit of stoneware in their lives. Well, that's because, what I'm saying. It makes you look put together. Yeah, it I really mean, does. whether you are I or know. you aren't. You certainly look like you know what you're doing because you really have the best of the best. And I'm telling you, if you were gonna get some stoneware, let's say at the mall or maybe that expensive kitchen store or even online, you'd pay $50 just for the stoneware roaster. If they even included a lid, I'd be shocked. If you could purchase a lid, I'd be surprised. But then you'd have to get that wire rack maybe at $20 separately. So, I mean, the clearance price on this, I would grab one for myself. I would, I would grab some of the accompanying pieces that we're about to present. And then I would grab one for the gift closet or maybe you already know somebody that would love it as a gift, pick a couple of these up. The reason we're at our clearance pricing is we're limited in colors. I know we're limited in quantity. So this is just the time to grab it as a deal. All right, we have about 950 of these left in all colors. If you want to pick it up, we're down to about a minute or so remaining. I just think that, you know, holiday sparks us up to, to do a lot of cooking and things like that. But throughout the year, You'll use it anytime, at Easter, you, yeah, anytime you want to do a big mac and cheese or you want to do a lasagna, you want to do meals where you have great leftovers, um, you, you want to do, uh, put a piece out that you can present. I will tell you one thing, I do not want to put a beautiful lasagna that has taken me half a day to put together in a cheap old metal pan and put it oh. on a table. It's it looks all like corroded. You, it looks like you bought it in the in the freezer section. This, when it right. comes in those pans, yeah. it may taste like a million bucks, but it looks like about four bucks. That's a beautiful lasagna. Isn't that a gorgeous lasagna? You want to know what's weird? Guess what I had for dinner last night? Lasagna. Yeah, yeah. exactly. And guess what you're going to have for breakfast this morning? There's a big <laughs> giant chunk of it left. There's yeah. a good chance you're well, going to have this and lasagna. And I, I don't own, <laughs> I'll be honest, I don't own this piece, but I you know the pie, yep. I presented it with you before, yes. and I remember saying to myself, why didn't I get this? I'm going to get so this today gorgeous. if there's any left. I have the mint, but my favorite is the black. Yeah, My favorite I know. Is yeah, the great. Black. We don't the have it. Oh, no, we have black in the other pieces. In the other you pieces. can mix and match okay. them. They're all the same pattern. So if you like to mix and match, feel free. Last call on blue if you want blue, all right? That's beautiful. All right, we're going to shift over and we're going to go over the bowls now. So, so what you're getting here, same style and design, same materials and stoneware, but this is a three pack of our uh, ceramic um, uh, mixing bowls. Yep. You can use them for anything salad bowls, hors d'oeuvre bowls, uh, whatever it is, pretzel bowls, chip bowls, whatever but you're gonna get three, three. of these, yep. okay? You get the one quart, a two quart, and a three quart. These are still available in black, in green, in blue, and in gray. We have all the styles. You get all three. I love uh, that they nest, so when you're so putting pretty. them on a shelf, they all stack on top of each other, and they're all perfect sizes for various, uh, yeah. for holding various foods. So what do we have? Our three quart, our two quart, and our one quart, yes. I think, right? Yeah, so we have three quarts here, which we, we're just showcasing different examples. You do what you will with them. Maybe you're gonna whip up a beautiful salad dressing. Maybe you're gonna bake in them. 
from, you know, you can do little cakes. Again, 400 degrees. Oven safe, dishwasher safe. I'm not sure we've mentioned that. These are completely dishwasher sure. safe. Um, three quart, two quart, and then we've got the one quart here with our French onion dip. Happens to be my favorite holiday dip. I don't know why. I know it's very simple, but it's so delicious. So you can use them for dips. I use mine a lot for serving when you're at a party and you're hosting and you don't know what to put the chips in. You don't know what to put the pretzels in. Maybe, you, you know, you don't know what to put your dips in. This is the set I go to, but I also do use it as my mixing bowl. So just like a uh, guy is about to do, gonna he's going to talk. He's I'm gonna, gonna make, make you a, a salad. He's gonna make a salad. I'm make you a and nice salad. And maybe you are doing like taco night and you put all the different fixings in your mixing bowls or whatever the case may be. But we have our lettuce, we have our croutons. Obviously we've got our dressing in our mixing bowls here. And then he's just gonna toss that up. But what a beautiful presentation. It's a great salad bowl. This is the black. Now this is the one we were out of in the roaster pan, but you can match back because they all have that same herb pattern. They're just different colors. Thank you, Guy, for serving welcome, me a beautiful darling. salad. A beautiful breakfast salad. Isn't that nice? Yeah, it is hey, very it's nice. never too early for salad. I'm not sure about that. <laughs> I think I might have to disagree. Sometimes I wake up and at 8 and, in the and morning and I'm like, salad. you know, I'd really I'll like have to... uh, scrambled eggs and a salad. And a salad. It is what it is. <laughs> no, but Listen, it's different times You're going to use this to, to toss your pretty. salad to mix up your homemade. Yeah. Because you could actually take, you know, your... your your oil, your herbs, sure. and your let you know your lemon juice, and just whisk away a beautiful yeah. homemade dressing in great, your mixing bowl. Great egg bowl when you're prepping your eggs for scrambled eggs egg in the morning Let's or whatever. I like the large bowl just because it realistically you have so many different uses out of that. If you're using it to mix batters for cakes and things like that, but. This is what sets it apart, you know, rather than just a clear glass bowl, these all have such great charm. And, and there's a story behind them, you know, these all have to, these are all made of stone, right? Like of clay. Hand painted. They, 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 put, they, they make them first, they let them dry, and then they are painted or what we call glazed, right? And then that glazing is put into an oven at about 2000 degrees and they're left there until the color bakes on. Yep. And that's what gives you the great um, nonstick property on the inside, which is what ceramic is so great and noted for, but it also gives gives you this great charm and this great feel like like you look at this this could easily be grandma's 40 year old bowl well, and that's the thing. even though these it's brand new are, these are the pieces you're going to pass down you know from generation to generation um these are going to pass down to your kids they're going to pass down to their kids i have my mom's um glass uh, roasting pan from the 70s and it looks so 70s and it's yeah. so precious to me but i use it i mean we all use it you know we throw it in the oven we do our lasagnas in it that's going to be the same you cake. don't know what the 70s were like do you know what the 70s i, were like? I don't yeah, i was born thanks. In the 80s <laughs> but um but early 80s so you know i've, oh, got, yeah. a, I've got an you were too young I've to seen, enjoy the 80s i've seen movies i've seen movies i know what the 70s were like <laughs> hey, but listen. you can see here each one of these has a different pattern yeah. right so but they're all the herb patterns so you can see this one and then it's on the inside too so they just match back perfectly to the roasting set even if you picked up the roasting set in a different color um i think you could mix and match the colors wouldn't you say i mean oh, i gosh, think they yeah. would look great together listen, at this price at $23 for all three bowls. Okay, these were $42.95. You have to understand the process that each one of these goes through. Okay, they're all they're all done by hand. That's how bowls are, are done in, in oh, they're ceramic. they're hand painted. They're all they're hand uh, painted, yep. all right, and glazed. All done by hand, and then they're fired, and that's what gives them that shine, and that's what sets the glaze into the actual pan, or into the actual bowl. But Honestly, great, great gift. Maybe a little bit too late for holiday gift, but get them for somebody anyway. Buy them for yourself. You're going to love these. Look closet. You never know yeah. when you're going to need them. There's nobody in your life that couldn't use a set. I yep. mean, they are just the perfect, and maybe just, you know, I like it for myself. I, I think I, I'm fantastic. a big a proponent of buying stuff for yourself. We have the loaf pans coming up in just a bit and the pie plates. So we're going to take a quick break, but we're going to come right back, so don't go anywhere. It's fun, entertaining, exciting, unpredictable, spontaneous, all of the above. It's a whole new way of shopping. Join us every Friday at 9 p.m. for the, the Friday, Friday Night, Night Show. Show. We're making bigger, even better with our Super Size Values, and they're available only at HSN. Super Size Values are based on the price per ounce of the same item in a smaller size and may not reflect a price at which HSN would sell the item. Have questions? Call us at 1-800-284-3900. We understand every woman's skin is unique. We offer real beauty solutions for individual needs of real women, empowering women to achieve healthy, radiant looking skin. Backed by over 30 years experience, made from important ingredients combined with advanced science for affordable skincare that truly works. Change the story of your skin and your life forever. Genuine beauty begins with skin.
continuing with our kitchen clearance here, everybody. I'm Guy, uh, and we are uh, enjoying uh, lots of great, great deals. Uh, Kelly is with us here as well. Uh, this is called housewarming, and I will tell you, some of the best stoneware you will ever find anywhere in the market, we're doing it at a fraction of the price today. So we just offered you the big, giant, giant um, lasagna-type pan. The roaster, now yeah. we're going to do our, our what we call our bakers. So you have a square baker mm -hmm. that is per so deep, eight it's by great, eight, three, right? By three, yeah. And, and, and nice and deep. And then we also have the uh, the loaf pan as well. Um, so uh, what a great way to be able to do, you know, whether you're doing a pound cake or you're doing, yeah, a, like you did here, a crumble, yep. ideal pans for that. It really is. So you're getting, so let me show you what you get. You get, let's see, one, two. You get two. both. Yeah, you're getting, um, and well, this comes with the lid. Let me just steal yep. that off there so I can show you the whole package. And the lids. And the lid. So this is eight by eight by three in your square pan. So eight by, this is really that every day. You're gonna use these for everything. I love the rack with the yes. square pan. So the square pan comes with the rack, just like the roaster. So look at the presentation on that. So maybe it is just you and a couple of others in your family. This would be perfect for a casserole, right? This would be plenty. We happen to do an apple crumble in here. Maybe it's for a dessert. What a great dessert pan. But again, 400 degree ceramic hand-painted, dishwasher safe, oven safe. It comes with the rack. You can see that beautiful hand-painted pattern on the outside. It's hand-painted and glazed on the inside inside and then this one also comes with your lid so there's that lid the, the lids do not go in the oven I just think it's worth mentioning and then you're getting I think this is eight and a half by uh, eight by four and a half mm -hmm. by three so three inches in depth so eight by four and a half by three inches in depth this also comes with the lid. If you own any stoneware, any kind of stoneware, I'm gear, I bet you it does not come with the lids. It is so hard to find lids to go with stoneware. Stoneware is great, but manufacturers don't make the lids. Especially that size, right? Especially yeah. in a loaf pan. Yep. So if you just want to have, if you use your loaf pan from everything to loaves to, you know, uh, casseroles to, sure. you know, dips, whatever the case may be, yep. it comes with the lid. This Meatloaf. One, meatloaf, obviously. Right? Perfect, yeah. right? So this one doesn't have the rack. You get the rack in the eight inch, but you get the loaf pan and and the lid, right? So you're getting all of this for $16.47. It's it's crazy. <laughs> it's really when it comes to stoneware, because stoneware is not cheap. It's expensive. It's as expensive to make uh, versus being stamped out of a piece of metal, which essentially is all that you get when you buy just regular roasting pans. Sure. So to get something that has some character to it and that actually has uh, people's hands involved with making it oh, um, helps to tell stories. So yep. um, we have it available in black. We have it in blue. We have it in gray. And we have it in green. The black is really hard to come by uh, in bakeware. I, you it's rarely, if ever, see black bakeware stoneware at any, even at the closeout stores, you don't find it. You don't. And when you go to the closeout stores, most things are chipped or they're picked over. This is all brand new stuff right out of the gate. And it's great. There's the black, by the way, we'll show you. Look how beautiful that, that is. It is gorgeous. And by the yeah. way, the square pan, let's go to the black. The square pan. Black will sell out first, by the, the way. The square pan and the loaf pan each have different patterns. So you can see there, um, that looks like cilantro or parsley or something like that yeah. to me. Um, the, they're herbs. They're all painted herbs. And then look back here. Look at how gorgeous that is. They're two different, but then when you open it up onto the inside, it's different. So it's the, it's the light, you know, um, major color, and then yeah. you have the black. Yeah the dark, but I love the black because I don't know, I have got a gray kitchen, so for something about this appeals to me, it's striking. You don't see it very often, it's unique, it's different. $16 it would go for both. For both, for not just both, but you're getting yeah. the rack on the square pan and you're getting the lid on both, the loaf. Have you ever had a loaf pan with a lid? I've never no. seen a stoneware mm -hmm loaf pan come with the included lid. So the lid comes included, so whether you're presenting these at a party or you like to yeah. entertain and you wanna just look, like I said, if you're just joining us, I said I like to look put together even though sometimes well, I may not be. Yeah. You, look, you appear as though and, you are. And, not, and you would never serve in a loaf pan normally. Okay, oh, because gosh, no, loaf pans are metal, just, well, yeah. and they're always so old Rusty. and seasoned and nasty yeah. looking. Yeah. This you could bring it right out to the table if you were doing some kind of a heated pudding or something like that. Yeah. Or we've got um, we did French toast, yep. kind of like a French toast loaf inside there. You can do things like that and bring it right to the table. And to uh, Kelly's earlier point, it's going to retain temperature yeah. so it keeps things nice and warm. Look or at, at the release. same time, you may you may do a Jello mold or something oh, inside yeah. here, right? I, I mean, there's so many things, and I use mine a lot for dips. You know, because it's like oh, I want to do a, a, a beautiful spinach artichoke. 
artichoke dip or a French onion dip. Oh, I'm not yeah. sure what to do it in. Look how beautiful that is. We did a loaf in our loaf pan. That's a gingerbread loaf. That um, just, how beautiful it you could smells do. Smells Maybe you do carrot cake for all your neighbors. Maybe you do like yeah. a dozen carrot cakes um, uh, at Easter. Maybe you do rum cakes at the holidays, and you deliver them in little cellophane to all your neighbors. I just say that because my neighbor just brought me a beautiful loaf. Say more food things. You're making me really hungry. Oh yeah, my neighbor. She, she did. She brought me this beautiful like loaf with cake. the cream cheese. Yes. Wow. Um, and it was all in cellophane that had the Look little this. ribbon. <laughs> uh, this is pull apart. This is That's beautiful. Ridiculous. Yeah. So this is pull apart biscuits and they're blueberry biscuits. And then um, Tracy just put a little glaze on top. Are those there. Ch chocolate chip or blueberry? Yeah, I think they're blueberry. Wow. Blueberry biscuits. And she just stacked them up. She Look just at stacked how nice. them up and did See, a glaze. And now bring that right to the table. 400 degree yeah. oven safe. Dishwash, I love that they're dishwasher safe, right? Yeah. And if you're wondering, well, why stoneware versus, you know, XYZ cookware that I have? Well, stoneware actually retains heat. So when you take it out of the oven and you take it table side, it'll actually retain the heat far longer than yeah. anything else you're probably cooking in. So maybe they, for an hour or more, these biscuits yeah. will be warm. This is, this is cookware, bakeware, that when you go to somebody's house and you see this on the table, you ask about it. Yep. And you don't so just pretty. ask about what's in it, <laughs> right? You look at this and you're like, okay, you first of all, where did you get that little thing with the stand? Who, who makes bakeware that comes with its own so stand? Pretty. And and it's ideal for buffets, for presentation, for even just to put on the table. I mean, you, you put, put it this way. You could take regular dinner rolls, heat them in the oven and put them in here. Oh, yeah. Or heat them in here in the oven and bring them to the table. Now the rolls are going to stay warm. I mean, it... Bottom line, it's a great, great piece. It just looks it's nice worth, for all the holidays that we do. It should never be on clearance, and it is because it's end of year, and yes. we're going to bring in more. This is all a customer pick, and if you read the reviews, you'll see... People are like, wow, this is really charming. This is the kind of stuff that That's I remember, you know, years ago that yeah. my mom had one of these pieces. And remember, very expensive to make, um, which is why you didn't see a lot of it a long time ago. But people don't have a lot of it because mm -hmm. it's it's time consuming, okay? This has to bake in an oven for hours for, for that ceramic to set up and the glaze to set up. And what it does too is it hardens it and gives it, uh, you'd be amazed, it's, it's, I never say shatterproof because yes, if you drop this from six feet on a on a, sure, on a it's, hard it's, floor, it's, it's going to break. It's gonna break yeah. But it's it's chip resistant. Yep. I, I've had my bakeware, the bakeware that I own, I've had forever. Whereas anything made of glass, gone. gone. Chips, yep. no good, and and blah blah blah. But because it's stoneware too, it doesn't. It, when it does chip, it doesn't chip like glass. Mm -hmm. It's different because it's stone, yeah. right? It doesn't. Same. You don't get those sharp and charred it's a edges. Glaze. And yeah. it's a natural glaze. So this is all natural materials. This is not like you have to worry about some sort of nonstick chemical leaching into your food. I get nervous about that sometimes yeah. Yeah. with certain things. This is all natural. All natural. I love cooking in it. You know, whether you're, you're the person that volunteers for the dip to bring it to girls' night out or uh, bunco night or at the church gathering or whatever the case may be. Now, each piece that you have, if you got the roasting piece, if you got the square piece, if you got this set, you're going to have the lid. And to me, even if it's just about putting leftovers right back into the refrigerator, like my apple crumble, let's say I didn't eat my whole apple crumble. I just got gave Guy a big serving, but I've got mm -hmm. leftovers. I can pop that lid right back onto yep. my square pan. Pop it. This one's eight by eight by three. I can take it right to my refrigerator. I don't have to worry about transferring it into food storage, right? Yeah. Because it has the lid included so you're storing in it you're baking in it and you're serving with it, it there are, we are down to 100 in black and remember you get both pieces you get the low so pan and pretty. you get the square pan they're both the same depth which is three inches which is ideal for baking um, without burning because you're gonna get really great results so if you're doing a souffle in here or you're doing an egg dish or things like that you have nice uh, depth for things to rise uh, or, or bread doughs stuff like that sure. it is it's really really three really perfect depth, yeah. and you will have this forever okay I'm telling year. you yeah. take decent care of it you know what I like I said you can throw it in the dishwasher it's fine I, I'm, I'm a it's so funny I have a dishwasher but I rarely use it just because I like to use my stuff all the time yeah, and I don't do want any same. downtime yeah, we do the same. but if you want you can um, remember $20 uh, in your account on any single item if you get a brand new HSN credit card today or can we go right into the pie plates yes Let's go right into We're the pie right plate. Right so, the so, pie so, so, so these, <laughs> these I picked up, and I will tell you, unlike any other pie plate ever, you know most pie plates are like half moon, right? Basically, they kind of arch, and then you know you get more crust in one bite than you do another. You know yeah. what I love about this is how purists inch. make pies. They make them so in, dishes in dishes like, dishes like, this. like this. So your pie is a deep dish pie. Yeah. You can do anything in here. You can do quiche in here, whatever. Oh my gosh, think of a, like but, a deep dish pie. But pizza. these are these are about They're what are they about? Two it's, inches deep? Yeah, it's uh, I think it's an inch. Little, and, little less yeah, than two inches. An inch and three quarters, something like that. And it's a ten inch pie plate. Wow. And when you get a pie plate, it's usually eight or nine inches. How much inches. is this? What? 
What? It's te it's nine. It's nine bucks. It's nine dollars. All right, there's some shipping on it, but remember, if you spend seventy five dollars yeah. today on clearance, you won't pay any shipping on anything. If I were you, I'd get Shop. the whole shebang. I'd get the roasting pan. I'm getting get off the air. I'm getting off the air. I'm buying this, this. I have the pie plate, and I'm going to buy the, the, the roasting pan. Yeah, the roasting. Yeah, pan. the roasting yeah. pan's great as well. I mean, for me, this is a must. And I never shop on Christmas Eve, but I'm doing it today. And I only make pies like a couple times a year for yeah. the rest of the time of the year. I use it for dips. I did a yeah. beautiful seven layer dip um, for Halloween in about, mine. You know, if you're and having, I made a little spider on top. You know, uh, spider you, web on top. you always do those girls' nights and things like yes. that. Actually, didn't you just recently have one? We did. Yeah, I think I was there. Yeah. Uh, anyway, because um, he's one I, of the girls. I crashed her girls' party because <laughs> it was down the street. I just showed up. Anyway, um, but that you can do all kinds of other things with this. Like, like I yeah. said, you could. This could be fruit salad in a bowl. You could put ice oh, in there. Oh, yeah, that's true. What about fruit shrimp, shrimp cocktail? Oh, let me tell you, right? a shrimp cocktail would look gorgeous. Perfect in there. You know what I did on Thanksgiving? I did um, a beautiful caprese salad in mine. Oh, nice. With a little balsamic yeah. uh, glaze because it's circular. Ooh. So it's a nice presentation. You also do a nice layered, the, the Mexican dip. Yep, the seven layer dip. Yeah. I did that for, so I did that for Halloween. And then on top, I took a piping bag and I made a spider web and I put a little yeah. spider in it for Halloween. So yeah. these are, I mean, you know, like I said, I like to look like I'm put together. I do the easy stuff. You are. I go to Pinterest I and I pick you the kidding easiest me, man. You're, you're and juggling like pies. 15 balls at a time. I watch. You. But it's all like on the outside. Know, Internally, I'm always melting down. All right. <laughs> if you want it, it's $8.97. It's a great oh, price. If you can't afford that, we'll pecan put it on Flex Pay. my favorite. Ooh, is that it's pecan? my favorite. You, are you a pecan pie person? It is my favorite pie on I always Earth. find like half the people out there don't no. like it. Oh, oh it's there's too something sweet. wrong with them. Oh. Carrie Maletto, it's too sweet. It's my favorite. Well, then go eat something salty. And I mean, it's supposed to be sweet. Eat a bag it's of pecan pie. Chips. And what then you did. He's on a tangent. Oh boy, our producer. Ooh, said. is that a banana cream? So, yeah, so this is a banana oh. pudding with some vanilla wafers and then a little bit of sliced banana. So, whatever the case may be, whatever you want to do with these, it's not just for pies. This is not your grandma's right. pie dish. You do everything in this. All right, you got to go 400 now. 400 degree. That's it. You got you, you have to stop now. <laughs> Zip it, Kelly. Go get some rest. Zip it. I'm on next hour. Well, that's, until then. Yeah, I'm here all get day. Get some rest. Get straight to your back, buddy. All right. <laughs> Kelly, great job. Love this stuff. All right, am I, can I walk? All right, I'll be right back. Bye -bye, I'll see you in a bit. See ya. Come on over with me. Where are you? There you are. All right, so we saved something special for you for the end of the show, and it's our, I call it a try me pressure cooker. Why? A lot of you out there know about pressure cooking. Maybe grandma did it or your mom did it or whatever, somebody in your family. And you know that it's a great way to cook because, first of all, you get all-day flavor in a fraction of the time. I mean, you could do a pot roast in less than an hour. You know what it takes a regular pot roast for me to do in a regular pan? Four hours. Corned beef, three and a half hours, about 40 minutes in here, maybe less, okay? And the flavor is... If it's not only every bit as good, I think it's even better because remember, when you cover something and you put it under pressure, the, the steam and the flavors, a lot of stuff that would normally, uh, you know, fly out into the air, goes back into the meat, goes back into the fruits and vegetables, whatever you're cooking, and it, it just instills flavor inside. So, when you order today, know that you are gonna be getting a ridiculous discount from 49 to 29. It's $29.98. If you always wanted to try pressure cooking, today is the day to try it. I have these available in red, I have them available in blue, plum, rose. Do I still have silver? No, I don't have silver, uh, but I think, and I, and I have teal. So, and I have, what, I, you sure we have a white? I don't see white. No white. Do White's have, gone. White's gone too. Yeah. Unless Kevin says we still have it. Kevin says there are still some online. Well, if you're ordering online, put your, pick your color and it'll hopefully be there. Carrie Maletto. <laughs> Hello, my dear. Good morning, happy, everybody. Happy holidays. Thank I you. love your earrings. Those are great. They're like little upside down Christmas trees. They're fantastic. Well, Carrie <laughs> is one of our kitchen uh, experts, and I will tell you, um, listen, we could all, all of us, if, if we've got a Sunday and we got six hours to cook, yeah, okay, then put it in a pan <laughs> and wait. But wait. most people don't have that time. That's 100% And they want to get results like with the same back. kind of flavor, <laughs> but in a fraction of the time with minimal mess or cleanup. Carrie, I love this two quart. Oh my gosh, this has been my new favorite little friend in the kitchen, and this will I be your favorite it. friend. This is a three pound pork roast here. So listen, if you want to do for the games, everyone's getting together, if you want to just make it for just you and someone sure. else, you know, the thing about a two quart here is it's got that really great everyday size, but look at how much meat I'm actually taking out of here. Wow. And as you said, we're cooking 66% faster. So whereas this would take about two and a half hours to three hours to cook this just right, look at this pork, unbelievable, you saw me just, it just fell right apart. And 
Look at those nachos. Those are some nachos. And I still have a ton left. If you actually look inside of here, I just did three sliders and a big wow. tray of nachos. And look at how much pork look I still have left in left. here. So you made enough food literally there for probably 10 to 15 people. Totally. I mean, Easy. come on. In Easy a peasy. two quart. Easy peasy. Yes. So, and what's great about this is that, and I'm actually going to leave that open because I'm going to steal some of that in just a second. Okay. What makes this great is what you were saying. It's about infusing flavor into your food and not having to babysit it either. So when I open up, look at this, nice and hot. Oh, mm. yeah. And you this look is inside my, there, it's bubbling. This is my mac and cheese. So um, this is, a, okay, so this is a 2 2, two recipe. Two cups of broth, two cups of cream, and two cups of Noodles. pasta. Okay, and then the big ending finale, right? Cheese, cheese, please, please. So, you know, macaroni and cheese this time of year, if you live anywhere where it's, you know, remotely cool out, uh, I feel you because wow. I live in Atlanta. But here's the deal. You can make absolutely the most delicious comfort <gasps> food like this mac and cheese oh, so quickly. So just as it sits, it's just melting. And you can always pop the lid on for another minute, let sure. it do its thing. Um, you know, we don't have a ton of time, but I want you to understand how delicious this is. now. The vessel inside, the chicord oh. vessel, is non-stick, so you don't have to worry. Yeah, that's there's nothing wrong with that. It's a non-stick right. uh, interior. Yes. But look at how much. You know, don't two quarts is a lot of mac and cheese. Gang. Yeah. Well, you know, because the thing is, I think when we see pressure cookers so often, they're eight quarts, ten quarts, really, really large. So we don't oh, necessarily pork. look at this. Are you going pork on uh, there too? Of course. Too? Okay, so let's do a little bit of this, <laughs> and then we're going to come back over here. It's clearance day, everybody. Oh my gosh. Let's make this happen. Yes. I'm gonna help you. Yes. Watch you want to top that? Yeah, Go for it. Ooh. Oh, I just made it perfect. Okay. So imagine all the fun that you can have and just those two meals right there. But Man. there's so, so, so much you can do with this. I'm actually going to pop this guy off let here. Let it do its thing. So I want to show you very quickly. This is only about six pounds. So it's nice and light. Yeah. So if you want to use this for parties, you want to bring this to different locations in the house. It's very light and easy to move around. Notice here it has the menu button. The menu has a lot of different options for you. So actually, let me stop. Okay, stop him. And then let me go back to my menu. And there we go. So now it's going from pressure high, pressure low, keep warm. Here you have the slow cook function. So this is also a slow cooker. Then it moves into searing and sauteing. So you always want to saute your meats and give a little caramelization before you start if you can, if it's a thawed meat. Um, here we actually have our keep warm function, which will keep warm for up to eight hours That's after perfect, it's done. Right? Exactly. So exactly. Your uh, rice and your egg function. So this will actually do the perfect hard boiled egg in six minutes. How incredible is that? I hear beeping. There's all kinds of anything oh, that's going to happen. So here, look. I want to show you guys, we were just talking about the party. Wow. Notice that the lid actually sits on top here. Yeah. So it actually hinges, okay? So most pressure cookers don't have that feature. And you have to take the lid off. And when you take the lid off, you have water everywhere, right? You got to try to figure out how to put it back on. I'm like, where am, I, where am I putting it? Where am I putting it? So if you're in a party situation, this is absolutely perfect. Let's grab a plate here. So these are my teriyaki meatballs. So I'm going to pop these out. So pretend you're at the party. How nice that this is able just to sit there and be very presentational, you know? So wow. I like that. And with the eight hour um, option, that means that these will stay nice and warm for the entire party. You don't have to babysit them at all. And you know what's really wonderful? I'm, I'm just reaching to your right here. You know what's great? Not sauce. only is the food that you cook in it, it's the sauce Look at that. that this makes. Because when oh, you pressure cook, oh, yeah. the sauce, your gravy is all, is made for you. There's very little work that you need. I'm trying not to get you there. I darling. know, I know. I'm There's very little you. work that you have to do. <laughs> exactly. Um, as far as seasoning and all that stuff, you can always add a little salt and pepper or whatever at the end. Easy but stuff. When, when you are cooking your food in the juice, it's especially true when you're doing like a roasted chicken in here. Yep. Or you're doing like a piece of beef. Yeah. And I, you know, I, and I, the, the easiest recipe on the planet Go buy a really cheap cut, like a top round or bottom round, pop it in there, package a French onion soup mix, like a cup of beef broth and a half a yes. cup of red wine. That's it! And then throw some carrots and onions in there and put the lid on. In about, in less than an hour, in probably about 45, 45 minutes, minutes, you will have pull apart, yep. pot roast, pull apart, Whatever it is, beef roast, and, I did, it, and the sauce is amazing. Check it out. I did frozen chicken. So I had boneless frozen chicken, and I put that in there, yeah. and I did a little barbecue sauce. So whatever you Perfect. cook, you just want to have a liquid. So about a cup of liquid for whatever you're cooking yeah. inside. And what happens is liquid turns to steam. Steam is then trying to escape, but it can't escape when it's in a pressure cooking environment. Yeah. It instead infuses back into the food. So the reason that you, you, you know, guys saying, it doesn't even matter, you know, this is a case 
place where if you can't afford the really, really expensive cut of meat, that's okay. Because any cut of, even when it has more fiber, you know, fibrous, uh, that's uh, where all the, flavor the tendons is. and all yeah, that stuff, that's yeah. where all the flavor is, right? Yeah. So that just melds when it's, when it's being pressure cooked. And you have low pressure, high pressure. Low pressure is seven and a half pounds of pressure. High pressure is 15 pounds of pressure. So depending upon if you're doing things like vegetables or a, uh, a tough sure. cut of meat or something yeah. like that, you'll do low pressure, high pressure accordingly. So, so uh, let's show them everything you're going to get when you're going to order today, okay? And this is it in black. I this believe, is it right? in black. Yep. Okay. So you're getting your cute, um, uh, you know, machine, and then it's coming with the rack here. So the rack is so that you can lift things up. So like if I do like uh, stuffed peppers, yeah. or you want to do something that you want to kind want of lift to it up on the bottom. Exactly. This is for your uh, measuring your water or your liquid, and then you also have your rice spoon that's coming with it. An extra that we have that I really highly recommend is a steaming basket because yeah, if you want to do hard boiled eggs. Available fish, all Kevin that sort of thing. Kevin will let us know if we have that. Yep. That, that goes inside, or you can yep. always find one if we, if we sell out. But I will tell you, right, right out of the gate, I did artichokes in it, whole oh, artichokes. Oh, perfect, yeah. And I will tell you, artichokes are the most time-consuming thing to cook. Like, literally, you put them on a <laughs> stove with boiling water. They have to boil for, like, almost an hour. It's crazy. In here, you could do artichokes in about 75% less yep. time, yep. and everything is tender and delicious. And you just put them on that rack. That's why they're reminding me of it, because of that rack. Yeah. And let them raise above. You wanna do meals that take a long time but you don't have a lot of time. What about things like chili, soups, stews, casseroles, things that, that need to be baked? All that cooking, the searing, everything is done in one yep. pan. And then you put the lid on it and you're done and it takes up you know, a small amount of space because this is the two quart, both vertically and horizontally, right? I, listen, That's right. I had, a, I had a, years ago I had a 10 quart pressure cooker. I gave it away. Yeah. Why? I wasn't using it. It's just me and Danny, and that. I thought, okay, I'll get the big one, because and I didn't use it. You get a smaller one, just like a regular pan. You're going to use this all the time. You there's, really there's, use it all the time. I don't think there's anything you can't so make in there. So I have a larger pressure cooker, but I also have this one. And the reason yeah. why I love it, so if you already have one of the larger, six quart, eight quart, whatever, the reason why this is a really nice companion, side dishes, because I made I made a big cabbage dish. I'm, ha I'm Italian, but I'm also part German. So in my German side of the family, we do like Polish sausage and kielbasa. Love like the sauerkraut and all of that. So I did that in the large one because I made a big amount, but I needed potatoes to go with it, but I didn't want to put my potatoes in because the, you want to cook potatoes at a different time than you cook the rest oh. of the stuff. So I used this guy, and this did two pounds of potatoes with no problem at all, so it really was fun. It was really easy, and I love that, again, I could have both of them going at the same time. You know this is going to be good. This is my steamed cake. Okay, so check it. You can make a cake, a box batter cake. You can also do cheesecakes in your pressure cooker. You just have to get a little spring form but here i want to go first with my caramel i get very excited when the cake comes out okay dear, I, this is you, a box you notice batter. i stopped talking this is a box batter okay so simple and easy now watch i did caramel yeah. and then i'm just going to take some whipped cream i love making fresh whipped cream at home by the way too because that's always better than anything you can buy oh my gosh okay look so i'm going to really top that guy yeah that's ba -doop, ba -doop, ba -doop. okay beautiful and then we're just going to do some very carefully placed berries and I want you to think about the last time you were at the store and you saw a cake like this, maybe like at the bakery yeah. center or whatever, how much were they trying to charge you and, for and it? Carrie, I will tell you, the best way to bake a cake ever is in a pressure cooker. Oh my gosh, because I, I mean, so you, first of all, you have moist heat cooking yes, your cake versus yes. dry heat. You want it to be moist, just like brownies and things like that. Do it in a pressure cooker. You need to try that. It is, when you cut into it, oh, it's like a pudding. It's super, yes. Right? That's a great way to say it. It yeah. kind of just melts in your mouth more than like, it's go, like my husband generally doesn't like cake and we have to do gluten free and everything else. But the nice part about this you is- see, it, You should see somebody about that, It by really the way, Because you should, everybody should like cake. He doesn't How like does cake. Doesn't like cake? Probably because it was hurting what him for so him? many years. It was making him feel bad, so I, he didn't really I, realize. So I think he associated. He got the gluten and all that stuff. Yeah. And yeah but I you know. know what? Whether it's gluten free or not, again, baking cakes in here makes it super simple. You don't have to babysit it. It's going to come out perfect every single time. And that was done in about 30 minutes. Um, here, we're talking about. Uh, this one's about 45 to an hour, depending on how much you put. This is my pot roast. Oh my so God. the pot roast Look here, come, I'm just gonna keep going, okay? I'm just gonna start pouring it is out. Is this not making you hungry at all? 
I know. It, 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 and then, it doesn't and then, matter what time of the day. It's like you see this. Remember when we told you this? before about the sauce? Okay, now the key to a really good pot roast, everybody knows, obviously cook it properly. Nobody wants a pot roast that's Look tough. That. So no. let it, give it the time. But the sauce that comes out of this, Look at this. is to die for. Let's get a little bit And by the way, sauce. if you run out of meat, please freeze the sauce and use it for something else. Ooh, but that is where, yeah. yeah, come on. Okay, because you know what happens with your sauces and with all of your, so like you saw me doing the turkey chili just a minute ago. You ever know Notice how when you do sauces or you do stews, that first day stew or that first day sauce can always be you know like a I little like. watery. It's not you really. You know what I like on pot roast? Oh my gosh, what are you doing? No, you try that. You put sour cream on pot roast. It's on, you have to try a little bit with the sour cream. It's really good. Oh my God, it is really good. <laughs> it's really good. I'm not weird, I almost put whipped cream I've on I've never it. done that. Okay, you know, yeah, well, don't well, do that. Well, because when you mix, see I do mine, I do mine over egg noodles. And when you mix it all together, it makes this creamy stroganoff. sauce. Stroganoff, I've done that that's with stroganoff. What that's, that's what you're doing. I just made, I just ripped off stroganoff. We just learned sorry, something from Mr. Guy. Though. I was Here, like, what is he doing to my food? I'm no. sorry, honey. Hey, but you know what? That's what happens in the kitchen. <laughs> you learn from each other. I know. You get tips and things like that. It's so good. The nice part about something like this though, let me tell you, when you've had a long day, <laughs> and you just wanna put all the ingredients in here, you wanna close it up. Okay, the way that this works is you just lock it like this. It has a valve here at the top. Um, so you have your pressure side and you have your steam side. So when you turn this, you see the little valve is in here. So it'll rise up when it goes to pressure and then when it, when it stops, when you're done, all you wanna do is take it from pressure to steam and the steam will come up and it'll release. That's called a quick release. And if you let it release on its own, it'll take about 15 to 30 minutes on its own if you wanna do a slow release. But the nice part is you'll always have it on steam when when you want to do um, when you want to slow cook okay so if you use this as a slow cooker mm -hmm. which you absolutely can then and that's what I love about this is it's actually like so many things in one yeah. um, you know it gets rid of a lot of extra appliances yeah. on your countertop and, and clean up right so I mean simple. you know you've got one Check thing it. and there's no spattering or no. spilling or any of that stuff so all you do is this actually the ring pops out um, for cleaning so I just always let that soak because the ring is what yeah. keeps the pressure so that's very important and then your non-stick bowl on the inside and I, I and the lid comes off you guys so I you know you've seen me um, actually placing it yeah, but look it, it comes off it comes completely cleaning. off if you want yeah. it to but I love again that feature that you really don't ever see on a lot of pressure cookers which is that it actually just sets on top like this I think that's mm -hmm. incredible so here we've done a beef pho, or pho, as you may know it, but yeah. pho is the appropriate way. Right. But that has been now the new thing. It's been very exciting. Very Everyone healthy. goes, it is, it's very good for you. They call it the hangover cure. <laughs> and the reason is because it's so brothy, right? And so the broth That's is what brothy. needs to be perfect with this. And you're gonna get that with pressure cooking. So now we can do all our toppings, perfection. We'll do a little bit of this across here. And if you had some hoisin sauce or things like that, you would wow. go to town with that. But I look mean, at, these are very expensive. These are $15, $16 at the ramen shops. Yeah. And you can make this again. For be, pennies. For pennies, <laughs> because the pressure is creating that long time cooking, <laughs> but 66% faster. You are gonna love this. It is the perfect size, small footprint. You rarely get to say that with a pressure cooker. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you've seen that we can make a ton of food with this, enough easily for six to eight people. Oh yeah. Um, because you know everything is very concentrated and you will put you can get a five or six pound roast in here I mean I mean that's enough for five or six people it's a pound of food for everybody <laughs> you will do it and you will love it it's easy to program uh, it does the work for you remember anything you put in there just add a little liquid that's that's the foundation of, of what pressure cooking is is you cook the liquid the liquid turns to steam the steam penetrates the food the food breaks down and as it, it it's immersed in flavor and when you try it, here's the other thing I love. Yeah. Is that, listen, I worked in the restaurant business for a million years, and I have very talented chefs and cooks and all that. You have, you don't need any cooking skill to be a really good cook with a pressure cooker. That's 100% true. Right? And I love the hands-free of it. So if you're running around, you got a lot of things going on, or maybe you get home late a lot, you can cook frozen meals in here um, in a matter of minutes. Um, you can do hard-boiled eggs in six minutes. I do my potatoes. Think about that. Boiled potatoes on the stove. Do you always see the boiling water going everywhere and it makes a ton of mess sure. and you have to sit there for like 20 minutes, 30 minutes waiting for your potatoes? Two pounds of potatoes in here. Wait for it. Six 
minutes That's crazy. is how long it takes yeah. for me to do them in here. And I'm not, I'm not boiling water anywhere. I don't have a mess. It's absolutely clean. I love it, love it, love it. If you can cook it, you can cook it in a pressure cooker. That's right. Uh, I'm just telling you, across the board, I have not found anything that I cannot really do inside a pressure cooker. It's kind of a challenge. Like you kind of well, like start going. Not, and we didn't even get to the point of how much money it saves you versus cooking in the oven, which yeah. you got to heat up a giant oven to cook something this big. Makes no sense. You're amazing. Thank you. I love so those are earrings. You. Those are adorable on you. Um, and you're <laughs> wonderful. Happy holidays Happy to you. Happy holidays. Happy right. holidays, everybody. All right, Miss Carrie Milano. Hey, by the way, we have, uh, I actually have this book. It's the uh, Simply the Best Pressure Cooker Recipes. If you're looking for ideas, you know, we'll make it easy to cook, but maybe you're like, well, what do I put together? This shows you how you can put together all kinds of great things and make wonderful one-pot meals. It's only $15.95, not a big discount, but it's a good discount. Grab that as well. And remember, you get $75 in your clearance cart. Everything is free, shipping and handling. So take advantage of that. We're gonna step away our best value of the day. You wanna talk about charming, old school, but great features. It's our today's special, coming your way next. I found it in Peru. China, Morocco, an amethyst mine in the middle of nowhere. Every day is a new adventure. We go right to the mines. You can actually show people, okay, this is how it all starts. And every rough material you get is like opening a Christmas present. You're able to sculpt it, make it into something that's really unique, very special, very limited. And I think that that's what people love. They know the history of it. Tis the season to be a VIP. Apply for the HSN card and instantly get $20 off when you're approved. As an HSN card VIP, you'll get the best deals on holiday shopping. Enjoy extra flex on beauty, fashion, and jewelry gifts all the time. And 12-month VIP financing on electronics, toys, and home items, $3.99 and up. Plus exclusive VIP offers. And there's no annual fee. Apply now. Call 1-800-695-1418 or visit hsn.com slash HSN card. Welcome back, everybody, and Merry Christmas Eve to all of you out there. Hope you have a wonderful, wonderful holiday. Uh, we're enjoying ourselves here. I love being in the kitchen. You know, that's where I plan on being arrested today and tomorrow anyway. But we've got some wonderful values for you. You know, when you think of cast iron cookware, which really 